Assalamu alaikum doctors in this video I am discussing a recall communication that is intraventricular hemorrhage. So intraventricular hemorrhage it may be the task is like that preterm or mechanical ventilation with intraventricular hemorrhage grade 3 with scissors. So I have to explain this to the mother or father. IRCAP as usual and uh, it's really a breaking bad news and information giving worth. I am deeply sorry to tell you that the jelly scan showed that she is having bleeding inside the brain or what we call intraventricular hemorrhage. Did you hear about it before? No. So let me explain for you. Imagine with me this is our brain. Inside our brain there is fluid filled spaces called ventricle. Because Ali is born very early and her uh, and his blood tubes are very fragile. She, uh, he developed bleeding inside this space pointing to the ventricle. Am I clear so far? So we can draw a picture of the brain and we can show that the, these are the some ventricles and there is a fluid uh, field space called ventricles. Uh, what happened? Ali born um, preterm early. That's why his blood tubes are very fragile. That's why he developed bleeding in this space. So, okay, doctor. Unfortunately, it is four grades from one to four grades where one is the best outcome and the fourth is the worst outcome. Fortunately, uh, he is on grade three. So we know that interventricular hemorrhage has four uh, types. If it is a medical student, you can tell that. So grade 1 has the good outcome where grade 4 is the worst outcome. Among them, he is on grade 3. So what are going to do? First of all, we will continue supporting him on breathing machines. We will give him medications for the seizures. Uh, we may need to do another jelly scan for him head, for his head and definitely are going to consult the nerve doctor. So we will support him. We give him the seizure medications. We um, give the... Um, breathing machine again we also need to do another jelly scan we will involve the nerve doctor so what about the surgery doctor so in the time of being the surgery will cause more harm than benefit because this condition occurred in first place as he was born very early and his uh, blood tubes are so tiny and fragile but again the best one to decide the nerve doctor so ab so about the surgery if the patient asks the, the surgery will cause more harm as the blood tubes are really uh, fragile and also tiny and fragile also for that reason. But we need to talk about the nerve doctor about this matter. So what will happen in the future? Unfortunately, we cannot tell you for sure what will be happen in the future as this scan or any scan will tell us about the structure, not the functions. But I'm really sorry to tell you that he may have difficulty in moving his arms. But if this happened, we'll support him by physiotherapist and occupational therapist. Also, he may not be able to speak probably. But uh, if this happened, we'll support him by speech doctor. Are you with me? So, um, first of all, we tell that he is on grade 3. Uh, the jelly skin actually tell the uh, structure, not the function of the level. But we are really deeply sorry. Even in, in futures, um, we cannot tell uh, that. But he may have, uh, um, the problem is that difficulty in moving his arms. But if this happens, we will support him by physiotherapy. So, we tell a complaints and um, then solutions supports by physiotherapist and occupational therapist. Also, he has maybe able, not able to see, speak. Speak problem. Then we have to, um, uh, speech therapist will involve. Okay. Also, he may have learning difficulty. And if this happened, we will support him by specialist in this field. So, if education problem, educational health care plan and support specialist we are adding. Adding to this, he may have loss of visions and hearing. Am I clear? Okay. I am so sorry to tell you that also there may be accumulation of water in this space. And if this happen, he will do a simple procedure by putting a tube from his head to her tummy to his tummy am i making myself clear so if uh, uh, there is a chance of there is a fluid in this uh, inside the brain if this happen we are just uh, need to put a simple procedure we need to do putting a tube from his head to tummy about shant we are talking okay doctor i will go to have a child with same condition another child no most probably no because it is not running in the gym it is just about the preterm babies then summary trusted website reflect as usual so this is all about intraventricular hemorrhage communication. Thank you.